Hi, this is John Paul with Retronyms, and uh, I'd just like to show a little bit about the new patch editor in Synth. So here I was just playing with a custom instrument that I created with the uh, patch editor. And uh, so let's take a look. You can just tap here to open it up. And you can see there are several uh, panels here kind of organized in broad categories uh, to control just about every, well, actually every parameter in the synth. So, um, you know, just to give a quick, quick example of a couple, uh, couple categories here, we have the oscillators panel, which controls the two oscillators inside synth. And you can freely adjust parameters as you're playing. So you have some controls over waveform and phase here. And you can always jump back to edit uh, delay and that kind of stuff. So um, in addition, there's you know your basic amplification envelope, uh, filter mod envelope, which can control a variety of destinations over time. So if these things seem foreign to you, it's a little handy that uh, on every backside of the panel, there's a description of all the parameters uh, that exist within, uh, in that panel. So you can kind of get tips and information as you're tweaking your synth. Uh, just to show a couple other uh, fun ones here, there's a, a pretty standard LFO. And then you can actually control what parameters the mod wheel affects. So the mod wheel can actually map to several parameters. Currently, it's controlling LFO uh, as well as the filter frequency. And you can actually get pretty precise with uh, some of these parameters, uh, similar to the way the iPad, uh, or sorry, iPod uh, uh, dragger works. You can actually control these draggers. The further you get away from them vertically, the more precise they get. So this is like a broad movement, and then as you go move down farther away, they get smaller, and you can actually control them uh, more precisely. So uh, you can also kind of set the instrument class and the sort of octave default that it sets to. So there's quite a bit of power in this to create kind of a, a broad sonic uh, range of synthy sounds. Um, you know, if you like what you have, you can always save it or uh, revert it. I'll kind of skip back to what I had before. So uh, I hope you enjoy this, this update, and, and I think it provides a lot of uh, power in a little... Uh, package here to, to kind of play with a synth. If you've never spent time tweaking a synthesizer, uh, it's a lot of fun. I can definitely lose hours to uh, messing around with synthesizer parameters to get the, the perfect sound. I also hope you enjoy the uh, free update of the uh, pitch wheel, which I've been having a lot of fun with.